Hello, my name is Brian Langford. I'm an instructional designer for the University of Phoenix. After submitting my assignment for class one, I received a comment asking if I could post instructions on how to add your Spark page to the assignment. And so this is gonna be a quick tutorial to show you how that is done. Now, the first thing you need to make sure that you do is create your Spark page. So make sure that you are logged in to spark.adobe.com and navigate to the top of the page where you're gonna see an icon with a plus sign and you're gonna click on that and you're gonna have three options either to create a post, create a page, or create a video. In what I did for this assignment is to create a page and you can see that here on the bottom left hand side of the screen. Once I was in this page I created a general title for the page, I added some images and while I was going through some of the course materials and the learning activities for class one I started adding a couple things to this page to keep a learning journal of some of the things that you learn while you're taking the course and so I added a little graphic uh, symbol uh, graphic that I created symbolizing the University of Phoenix kind of colorful I added a little silly picture of me along with my name so people could get a, tell a little idea of what I look like and I posted a little introduction about who I am and what I hope to get out of this class. After getting into Illustrator and completing the class one assignment I also posted that into the page. After I was done completing the assignment in Illustrator I went back into the classroom to read through step five which is the class one review and after I had completed that step I was allowed to upload my assignment. Now as you can see here I've already uploaded it but I can show you through clicking the edit button how I attached my Spark page to the assignment. Now in the assignment I created a title, I added a little reflection about some of the reasons behind why I created the badge that I did. I uploaded the image into the assignment file section of the assignment and now you'll see right beside it there is an assignment videos section where you'll be able to add not only videos that you created but also you can add your spark page now what you can do is you click on the button to add a video now for this you're gonna have to go back to your spark page and retrieve a video URL now in this particular case we're not grabbing a video URL but we are gonna grab the URL for this page and to do that you're gonna click on the share button at the top of the Spark page. Now, once you do that, you're gonna see that there is an option to copy a shareable link, and that is the link that you are gonna grab from this page. And so I'm gonna click the copy button, and now I'm gonna go back to my class one assignment. There we are, and I'm gonna paste that URL directly into the video URL field. And Along with that, I'm going to give this a title. After I give it a title, I'm going to click the Save button, and you're going to see that that link is listed in the Assignment Video section. I'm going to add the Adobe products that I used for this assignment, and then I'm going to click the Save and Publish button. Now, I'm not going to do that here just because I've already done it and I don't really want to change anything. But that is how simple it is to add your Spark page to your assignments in this course, the Graphics and Illustration for Educators course from Adobe. Thank you so much for watching this. If you have any additional questions, please uh, ask them in the comments section, and I will try to respond to you when I'm able.